This is my reaction to She-Ra and the Princess of the Power Season 4, Episode 4, Pulse. In the last episode, um, Adora and Bo went to, like, save a village and stuff. Oh, and Swiftfoot, too, of course. He was obviously there. Um, and they saved the village, and then they were throwing a party. But then, um, Adora and Swiftfoot had to leave real quick to fight off a bot. But then, it was a trap. And then, they kidnapped everyone there. But then, um, Flood Arena helped save them. And then they recruit Flood Arena for the Rebellion. Except for the fact that it wasn't Flood Arena at all. It was actually Double Trouble pretending to be Flood Arena. Also, if you like full reactions to She-Ra and other shows that I react to, you can join my Patreon for only $5 a month. So, yeah, let's go. Now. <laughs> Boom. Nets. Everyone be ready. Our scouts reported the Horde is transporting a new prototype weapon, and they wouldn't brave the Whispering Woods unless it was something powerful. If I know Entrapta, this thing is gonna be big, unpredictable, and... Nothing. Uh-oh. So, what's the plan now? Did someone say, Swift win? <gasps> Swift <laughs> Oh. Someone say... Oh, don't be rude. But you just did. Oh! Anyway, I tracked down the path the transport was on. It came from the mountains on the far side of Bright Moon. To the war room? We've got a mission to plan. Great, let's go. <coughs> <gasps> yep. Oh, sorry, Your Majesty. Sorry, Flutterina. I didn't see you. Oh, it's okay. Are you guys going on a mission? Can I come? Not this time. And not all of us are going. Next time, then. Rebellion Soldier Flood Arena is ready. Have fun. You should have seen Glimmer's face when she realized she'd been outsmarted again. How is the Horde always two steps ahead? Angry Sparkle, growl. <laughs> and any intel That's on she -Ra, or are we done here? So serious. Remember, this is supposed to be fun. she is not going to find anything, but they'll all see the weapon when the time comes. Ooh, foreshadowing. <laughs> Love this. No, no, she can practice like fighting. No, no one's around. Oh. What are you doing? I'm the daughter of an angelic being and a powerful sorcerer, and I'll never be as good as either of them. That's true. <coughs> You'll be better. <laughs> no. Don't you remember your raw, magical energy? You must decide for yourself what kind of queen you will be. And I've decided. I'm a queen who doesn't take advice from prisoners. Ooh. So she's still a prisoner? Stay close and stay quiet. Just for the record, I'm being way quieter than Guys, you. Guys, <coughs> you hear something? Ha! Two for one! Still winning! <coughs> oh, snap. Is... is that the new weapon? Oh, blew out the net. Hello? Oh, is this gonna heal him? Yeah. Win. Oh, 
No. If the horde is tracking you, they're gonna be ready. What if Glimmer? You said it yourself. We can't risk more people getting hurt. General. Don't worry, Bo. I'm gonna take care of this. <gasps> Damn! Double trouble. Catra, I knew you were behind. Oh, it. hello. most vulnerable part of the body that I refuse to cover because I don't own real shirts. <laughs> <laughs> if only I was there to sparkle at it. Oh, oh this is double trouble. Oh, in person. Oh, okay. I was like, what are they doing? <laughs> All it takes is a few ingredients and the will to see it through. You've been growing magic plants this whole time? <coughs> what do these do? Those daisies. <laughs> I find them cheerful. Now, the final ingredient added by the spellcaster. She'll know we're coming and clear out before we get there. Catra won't be expecting an attack. Her attention will be focused on Adora. It would be the perfect time to strike. <gasps> Are you suggesting I use Adora as bait? As a distraction, but the decision is yours alone. I mean, that is smart. What? And it's not like Adora's gonna be pissed about it, I mean, I don't think. I mean, maybe she should have let her know, but, like, you know, share a text. You know, I'm sure there are no phones in this world, but, you know. No. Princesses stick together. We'll find it. <laughs> you wanna fight some bots? See, Adora? She is just as competitive as I am. <clears throat> See, this is why no one comes to game night anymore. Adora, tell her. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> People don't come to game night because you insist on serving vegetable platters. Ew. No one likes vegetable platters. Right, Adora? Fall back! So when it's drilled in is when it's launches this missile beam thing. Oh, shit. And they're drilled in. That's also drilled in. Oh no, now it is. What are you doing, Dad? Oh, she thought that was double trouble. Oh, it's you. <laughs> Who else would it be? <laughs> yeah, okay. She she's like, oh shit. Using your own friend as a decoy? Wow. Didn't know you had it in you. Guess you don't know everything. Ooh. Ooh! Oh, snap. Oh, snap. I don't think that's good on anyone's part. Ooh. Damn. She plays dirty. Ooh, so does she, apparently. Oh, I guess she doesn't have to choose. Looks like I don't have to. Ooh. But you know Cat is gonna get out of there before. Like, it blows, right? Well, is she not out yet? Oh. Well, that was cool. Yeah. 
That's my girl. Oh. Oh, wait. Oh, no, that one's down. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Oh, oh, okay, okay, thank you. But until we do, at least we can use it to our advantage. By using me as a decoy? Oh, she's not so happy about that. I know it was dangerous, but it was the only chance I had to take out the rest of the bots before Katra could unleash them. And it worked. I'm not going to stay behind anymore. That's not the kind of queen I am. Mm. I want to be out there fighting to protect my kingdom side by side with my best friends. And now that Shadow Weaver is teaching me magic, I'll be twice as effective. What? Shadow Weaver's teaching you? Guys, we <laughs> won today and no one else got hurt. Well, I live to serve. For a price, of course. Ooh. What's the price? Oh, money. And don't worry, darling. I'll keep a better eye on Glimmer. Who knew she was so powerful? <laughs> Whatever. If she hadn't used Adora as bait. Oh, yes. How devious. I'd assume she was all glitter, no grit. Yeah, that was unexpected. And then she showed up alone. Huh. Looks like the friendship might have a few cracks, huh? <gasps> Shame if someone were there to take advantage of them. Oh. That's my reaction to She-Ra and the Princess of the Power Season 4, Episode 4, Pulse. So, um, because of, um, Double Trouble infiltrating the Rebellion, they were able to tell Catra wherever they would be so they could constantly ambush them. Um, until Glimmer talked to Shadow Weaver and learned, like, a location spell, um, to see where Catra really was. So she used She-Ra as bait, or a decoy, um, while she went in and attacked the big pulse weapon and Catra. And she did pretty good. If it wasn't for Double Trouble showing up, she could have got Catra, but Double Trouble did, and they took Catra out of there. And then Catra thinks that there are now cracks in the friendship of Glimmer and Adora, and I think she's going to have Double Trouble go out there and uh, do things with that. So, yeah, that's it.